Well, right, right now we're at our uh, workshop facility located here at uh, number five Commerce Street, which uh, is one of uh, historic's, uh, one of Frederick's historic buildings. Used to be a cannery, and we have uh, adapted that to be our shop facility, where we do most of our uh, shop fabrication for our project work, which happens throughout the National Park Service, and we are the uh, historic preservation training center and the mission of that center is to provide preservation trades education for National Park Service employees and our partners as well as safety, construction management, planning, design and construction and developmental activities. We have about 45 or 50 employees that report to work here uh, but they don't do always work in this location. They'll go out uh, to our local projects, uh, say at Harper's Ferry or Antietam, up to Gettysburg. We travel down to Prince William Forest. We do a lot of work for our uh, National Park Service sites in the district. And then, of course, we're, we have crews working right now in Hawaii, uh, down at Gulf Islands and near Pensacola, Florida, at uh, Castillo, San Marcos, and uh, St. Augustine, uh, Florida. So we work throughout the national park system. We are entirely a project-driven organization. And when I say projects, the work we do uh, involves uh, preserving, restoring historic structures in any of the almost 400 National Park Service units around the country. Now, we don't do all of the work, but we tend to do the kind of work that's hard to contract out. The work that uh, there's so many unknowns, it's very difficult to get a contractor that'll give you a bid for that job. So we're really a uh, design-build operation within the National Park Service. And what we do, and this is really the, the thing we've done, I think, very well since our founding in 1977, is we combine training with our project work. So we actually use our projects to train our National Park Service employees, our maintenance employees, and more importantly, the individuals you see working behind me here, our project managers. It, it's, it's a privilege to work in Frederick. It's a wonderful community, has a great sense of its own, own history, and it, we've been so fortunate to have a great partnership uh, with the city of Frederick, uh, that we're fortunate to be here. Uh, it's a wonderful place for us to work. Uh, we're able to recruit uh, a great workforce, and, and I just feel uh, privileged to work with uh, the very talented staff we have here.